now that we've changed the background color, it's time to change other components. So if you select the rank rectangle, this is the stationary rectangle, go to conditions one, add color, set the hexadecimal to 4C6EF5, and I've added a shadow here. Zero 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 nine two E duration of zero point five and a start to value of zero point one nine. We want this to happen after our background colour has transitioned. So let's have a look at that in the preview. Okay. It might be a little bit too slow, so let's change the values there. Let's take away the start delay and let's have a wee gander. Mm, a little bit too fast, so maybe add 0 0.1. Yeah, I think that's looking good. Let's do the reverse action, adding the colour condition there to conditions 2 hexadecimal at D E E C F F and a shadow of eight zero eight zero eight zero and a duration of probably about zero point four five and let's add another start delay there zero point one and let's have a look. Cool. And that is how you make the, the colour transitions for the stationary rectangles.